Welcome to Technically Speaking. My name is Glenn Schuldis. I'm the Applications Engineer here at Wilson Tool. And today I'd like to talk to you about the concept of stage bending and what we call stage tooling or common shut height tooling. So the concept of stage bending is very common in the precision metal fabrication industry. You're always trying to bend a sheet metal part in one complete setup. So bend the part completely without putting the part down. Um, in practice, that sometimes is, is very challenging because a lot of sheet metal parts require multiple styles of tools in order to complete the bending. So um, just as simple as needing a different V opening can make it uh, impossible to bend the part in one setup. So I have here two different V openings and the traditional way of making these tools like I have here is for the shoulders to be at the same height. Um, I can't use these two tools in the same setup because the, the shut heights of the tools are different. So when I put the punches on, we'll see the, diff the different shut height. So I can't use these two tools in the same setup. So this alone means that I can't bend a, a job that requires these two tools in the same setup. So in contrast, over here we have an example of stage tooling or common shut height tooling. And we can see we have a flattening block, a couple of different 30 degree dies, a couple of different 75 degree dies, and the shoulders are all at different heights. But what that results in is a common shut height. So if I put the punches on, I'll see that all of the shut heights are the same for all of these tools. And now I can run in and mix and match any of these tools or any of our stage tools or common shut height tools all in the same setup. Um, so I can bend all of my stages in one setup. So I'd like to bend a, a simple sheet metal part that uh, has several different styles of bend and we'll, we'll see how stage tooling can allow us to do that in one setup. So let's get started. Okay, so this is the simple sheet metal part that I want to bend. It's a pretty common type of profile where I've got a hem here followed by a couple of bends that will require a small gooseneck punch to complete those bends. So that could be a challenge to do because of the 30 degree punch that I want to use to start my, my hem, the flattening tool that I want to use to flatten it, and the gooseneck tool that I want to use to, for the last couple bends. But because these are stage tools, I can use those all in the same setup like this and they'll work perfectly. So let's go ahead and bend the part. there we have it. That's stage tooling. So using this simple sheet metal part, we demonstrated the idea of how common shut height tooling or stage tooling can allow us to bend a sheet metal part in one setup, even though it requires multiple styles of tools. I hope you find this video helpful. Uh, if you do, please click like. Um, if you have other ideas for what we could do for technically speaking videos, please uh, put them in the comments below or send them to the email address that you see on the screen. And for Technically Speaking, now you know.